Hey, not really specific here. What is an atom? Well, as most of you already know, an atom is a basic unit of a chemical element. Atoms are made up of three subatomic particles, protons, neutrons, and electrons. But are atoms just a fundamental piece of matter, or something more than that? Like a solar system. Protons and neutrons make up the center of an atom, which is classified as the nucleus. Electrons orbit around the nucleus. The space in between the nucleus and electron is huge, for the scale of size it's on. In fact, if the nucleus was a golf ball, the electrons would be one and a half miles away. But what else in the universe has so much space in between the center and the objects orbiting around it? A solar system. Like an atom, a solar system has a center. A star. With objects orbiting around it quite far away. Solar systems and atoms have a lot in common. But does this mean that our solar system is an atom? In the year 964, a Persian astronomer by the name of Al-Sufi described and depicted a galaxy we know as Andromeda. Al-Sufi described it as a little cloud lying before the mouth of a big fish. Andromeda is 2.4 billion light years away, traveling at a speed of 3 kilometers per second. It seems like a fragment in space, maybe even an object. Could our tiny planet just be an electron? Most likely, we will never know if our planet is an electron or if atoms in our world are solar systems. But take a book as an example. It could very well be a galaxy. If an atom was a solar system, then any objects containing atoms would be galaxies. As Plato once said, astronomy compels the soul to look upward and lead us from this world to another. That's, That's all for now. Thanks for watching. watching.